10 year old shoots and kills another 10 year old in the don't give a fuck community. So no news will be made about this. Nothing will be, you know, really no big. I mean, there should be a public outcry and people should be coming together. Everybody from Farrakhan to, you know, anybody that represents black people, you know, your local preacher, everybody should be up in arms. There should be every which type of social conversation. But are those social conversations happening? Hell fuck no. Utter abject total silence. As a matter of fact, only, only if you just so happen to come across this video is this topic even being discovered or, or better yet talked about. And um, there's a female who covers black girls being killed in the community, being that she has a much bigger platform than me. I desperately went on Twister, uh, Twitter and tried to see if she would share this story. And, you know, it doesn't have a girl at the center of it, a black girl. So, uh, no, she said, uh, talk about it on your own platform. I'm like, really? <laughs> like, really? I mean, just just let us sit back and let's let that marinate for a minute. And that's exactly why it happened. Like the mothers of these kids or would be kids, man, they don't give a fuck about these boys, man. And I hope that stories like this, if you're a black male under the sound of my voice, even though I know that not anything is going to change too much, man, I can only hope that y'all listen to this, man, and see this level of disregard for you. You're just to them existing trash because they don't think too much of themselves. So they're not going to think that much of anything that comes out of them. Not enough to raise it in a way to have a more loving societal uh, existence, a coexistence with other men and people who are just like you and I, black males, like motherfuckers going around Chicago, Detroit and anywhere where there's a bunch of black people just always mean mugged up with their fists balled up and always having to have these attitudes toward each other because you're born men. Bro, that shit is like garbage because it's not anything that you can display socially, publicly as being something that is victorious to you. Like I'm this way and it's something that I benefit from and it's something that the world benefits from. No, you're just a nigga sitting up there being stupid and looking crazy and mean mugging and hating the other dudes that look just like you. That's it. That's all, bro. You don't really get no points for that. Not at the end of the day, really. You're just a nigga and everybody hates you. And you're a dummy who's a subservient slave to a fucking woman. Give her your sperm and identify yourself as the great magnificent man because you got a lot of hoes. Even though she's taking your kids off somewhere and not giving a shit about them. Neglecting your kids, beating on your kids, calling your kids all type of little niggas. All the way to the point that that's what they address themselves as. Nigga, 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 nigga. A completely dehumanized, subhumanized title. It's, it's even stuck in my head. You, it, you know, I have to try to sit up here and, and deliberately make myself not say it so much. It's a total defilement. It's absolute and complete evidence that you're raised like trash and that there's no regard really shown towards you. You're a fucking dummy. Like, and then I'm going to say this right here. In every aspect of how your black woman uses you, she defiles you in it. Even as the boy who's sitting up there living with his mama. It's important that a woman has to have some type of man around her. If a female is going to grow old, there's something I'm going to tell it to you like this right here, bro. Culturally, she's going to drag her sons. If, if she's going to grow old along, culturally, she's going to drag her sons along with her. That's the dude in his basement, in, in his mama's basement. That's the dude 
She deliberately did it to him. She has to have some type of man around. Who's going to rake the leaves off the roof? Who's going to mow the yard when, when she get 50 something years old? And they make Negro males not shit to the point that they realize they're not shit at a young age and don't have that much of a regard for one another. Combined with irresponsible dumbasses leaving guns around, there's more guns in America nowadays. You got to be very careful about what the fuck you leaving a gun if you got kids in the goddamn house. But that's just some irresponsible shit, man. My nerves be flying off the meter when it's kids over here. I got five guns. I am fanatically making sure that my guns stay in my room and there's like I only have two on my person but three at my mama house <laughs> up in the country but the two that are with me I make sure that the motherfuckers are secured at all times and just and I'm triggered because like I said I attempted to share this story it's a sad ass story but I attempted to share it with some female, a person who covers murders and killings that go on in the community. And she basically said, do it on my own platform. It didn't pertain to a black girl, which is the only thing that they care about. And here's, here's the thing that's crazy, man. The female that wouldn't share this video, man, the female is married to a black man. <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> Like, you two motherfuckers could reproduce boys just like this, you know, this situation here. What is this thing with women like? I'm going to tell you something. The man that's, 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 that's with her, he's not the man. He's something else. He's an object that's there. He's an object that's there. He's not no man. This bro can't possibly tell me that the level of disregard she had for these boys that she would all of a sudden activate a massive amount of love, concern, and vigilant motherly care for male children that she had. No, she would not care about them. She'd throw them away. She'd treat them like shit. And she'd exalt her little girls to be the next leaders of the matriarchal black-ass community. Fuck out of here, man. We are fucking whack, crazy, and tragically and sadly, you're going to hear even more stories like this. And the silence will be deafening.